BAFTA, the BAFTA Special Award goes to the very special Peter Bennett Jones. Thank you for this award. Thank you, BAFTA, and thank you to my colleagues. Peter Bennett Jones, recipient of the special award at tonight's BAFTA Television Awards. Huge congratulations. What does this award from the Academy mean to you? Well, it, I mean, it's so stunning, really. I mean, I'm a backroom boy. I'm happy to be so, but when you get a little moment like that, it's all, it's all down to the comic relief work and connections and these wonderful people I work with. It's just... Uh, it's, it's thrilling and humbling at the same time, so it's great. Let's talk about Comic Relief. You were there back in the beginning in the 80s, and Comic Relief has not only entertained us all through the years, but most importantly raised millions and millions of pounds for some seriously worthy causes. How does that make you feel, to have been there in the beginning and seen it all the way through to now? I know it's a very personal... Well, no, no, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm Richard's enforcer, you know, uh, 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 and it, it's a great privilege to front something like that in, in just terms of, uh, of making sure it's run properly, the money is spent properly, and these guys do what they do so brilliantly, and the BBC let us do it. So if that is in some way acknowledged, it's, it's a totally joyous thing to be involved with. Yeah. And uh, the way the public just embrace it more and more every time we do it, every year, creativity gets, you know, increases and the money increases. It's a virtuous circle. And you can see from some of those films that are getting honoured tonight, people care. And if we can get that engagement, then uh, we've done our job. Long may, long may that continue. And, um, you know, as the chairman there at uh, Tiger Aspect, over 500 titles have been broadcast mm -hmm. under your name. Do you have a proudest moment? Is there one that's a favourite? I mean, it's like choosing a favourite child. It must no, be almost impossible. I don't think it was Freddie Starr and Beat the Crusher. But... Uh, <laughs> Bless you. Oh. <laughs> the Vicar of Dibley is obviously out on its own. <laughs> it's the highest, it the highest quality, the, vi uh, the Vicar of Dibley, and anything to do with Richard, obviously, <laughs> and anything to do with James Corden. That, that okay. basically does it. It's there, just standing, just over there, oh, no, right no. now. Fantastic. How are you going to celebrate this evening, do you think? Well, I'm looking forward to having a little drinky now. I'm not yeah. averse to a drink. Uh, uh, just, just, just glory in the moment. Okay, and what would you say is the truth to discovering new talent? Because you've done just that with so many of our best loved in this country. Well, get get down and get dirty, really. I think you know. I mean, it gets more challenging as you get older, actually, and and, and fatter, as was well pointed out. But uh, you, <laughs> you have look quite svelte. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, you have to get out and see the clubs, and when you see, uh, you know, I wish I represented James. You've got to be get in there early, and then just build a long-term relationship, and that's great fun as well. Okay, well, congratulations, Peter, from everybody at BAFTA. Have a wonderful night. Thank well you. Well deserved. Lovely Thank you very you. much. That's very sweet of you.